Hi, my name is Isabel. I work as a portrait artist. I am comparing a Corel Draw and Adobe Illustrator. I use both. And for more reviews like this, click below. I tried out using um, Adobe Illustrator and Corel Draw um, for creating um, elements for fantastical portraits that I create that I didn't have a picture of or I couldn't find a stock image that worked well enough for me. Corel Draw is absolutely fantastic for um, drawing anything out that um, you want to have printed is what I have discovered. So if you are going to have, if you want to make something um, just look amazing and also have it print amazingly, um, I have found that Corel Draw works the best <laughs> at it. Um, so uh, that is what I use it for. Um, they also just have a lot of other handy things with it. Um, you know, you can use it on tablets and it can work between different devices and um, you can, uh, it helps you draw things um, nicely with different textures and things like that. Um, it's just, uh, you, it even has a community so you can draw something, you're not sure if it looks right, you know, you can post it in the community and then people will kind of critique it or give you good ideas and things like that. So um, Corel has ended up working out best for me. Um, so Adobe Illustrator is wonderful if you're a graphic designer. So if you are designing um, graphics or logos or things that go on the internet all day long and you're dealing with small businesses that are just starting up and they're like, I just need a simple graphic or something like this. Um, and you know, they're not so worried about how it prints out and, um, uh, and you know, that, that graphic that you make, it'll look fine on a business card, you know, but it doesn't have to look so true to life um, like my portraits do. Um, really they're fantastic and I, I feel like they're you know the industry standard and the nice thing about it being an Adobe um, item is that you know if, if you do something in Illustrator but you need to add something over here in Photoshop you know it all communicates uh, so I feel like more so for the graphic designers who are just you know putting stuff more so out there on the internet or just little things like business cards or just like a little sticker that needs to go onto a product it's absolutely great for them Okay, so for Corel Draw and um, Illustrator, um, both of them aren't are aren't too bad if you already know um, these drawing type programs. Um, so if you're if you're really really familiar with Photoshop and now you're thinking of getting into graphic design, um, Adobe Illustrator is fantastic because I mean you you feel like hey here are the same things that I used in. Photoshop, but now it just works a little bit differently in Illustrator. So it's actually pretty easy um, to get going. Uh, Corel is, um, it, it's a workhorse when it comes to <laughs> this type of artistry. Um, so for that one, it's, it's a little bit harder, a little bit of a higher um, learning curve um, if you haven't worked with them before. Um, but if, if you're an artist type and if you've been playing around with different types of programs that are out there for drawing things or whatever else, or painting things, because Corel also does painting, um, then moving over to Corel Draw is a piece of cake. But if not, um, expect to maybe spend some time on YouTube uh, learning a few things. So my top considerations were really um, how, how true to life and how, uh, and how awesome can it look when this when the pieces are printed because um, my smaller pieces that I sell are 60 inches so it had it just had to have a lot of um, have, have really good resolution to it um, it had to look like it was already existing there in the portrait um, and it had to uh, be something that I was able to work with you know and I started playing around with Corel draw I'm familiar with Corel Painter um, already because I do make painted portraits and I was like, oh, I, I, I can do this, you know? Um, and then, and then the, the community ended up being um, a bonus because now I can get some critique about, oh, this, this actually might be better this way. Um, Adobe doesn't um, have that yet and I don't really know why. Uh, so, and then it's nice that Corel has, has ways that it can go onto all these different types of tablets that exist for artists um, and it can just move between the different tablets. Um, so 
the convenience was nice, um, but my main thing I was worried about was how good is this going to look when I print it on a big canvas and is it going to look real? And Corel solved all those problems and uh, Illustrator was just a little bit behind and, and I'm picky about how great I want something to look, so I'm stuck with Corel.